Getting started with the MPM100 multi pigment meter. Inside the carrying case is the MPM100 unit, USB data cable, four rechargeable AA batteries, charger and local adapter, and manual on USB stick. Here is the MPM unit with the manual leaf clip. To switch on the MPM, hold down the power button and wait for the home page to load. Press Run Application. To calibrate the MPM, press Run Calibration and wait for calibration of all sensors and detectors to complete. Next, select a new data file name by pressing Use Default or select Alt to edit the name. From the measurement screen, press the cog icon for test setup. Select the trigger for measurements, either manual, automatic, after jaw cycle, or sample present. This is the recommended intelligent mode. Press sample averaging to enter a value from one, no averaging, to eight. The last seven measurements are averaged to give one final value. Press leaf side to select either auto or manual. In manual mode, press an icon on the screen or in auto, a data label indicates either the adaxial top or abaxial bottom side of the leaf. Manually turn the MPM or the leaf over to change the side being measured. Select the fluorescence gain mode, either auto range, whereby detection gain adjusts for each sample, or locked, whereby gain is kept constant at a value of one to five. Change the data logging file. Both a protocol and a test data file are generated for each set of measurements. The test data records the sample number, leaf side, date, time, and GPS data. The protocol file stores all parameter data. You can edit a maximum of five parameters, e.g. chlorophyll, flavanol, anthocyanin, and NFI. Formulae for each parameter can be edited here. These are steps taken to calculate from raw data. From the measurement screen, the question mark icon explains the contents of each screen as you enter it on the MPM. A print screen can be taken here for reference. This is saved as a bitmap file. Use the back arrow to return to home page. File Explorer displays a list of stored files to view. View files here. BMPS are stored print screens. Return to home page. Press system setup to view and edit settings. Turn system sound on or off. Set the MPM auto power off timer in minutes. Any saved protocols are listed here. Check and set the date and time here. The diagnostic screen allows you to view fluorescence and transmittance signals and battery status. The fluorescence gain level can be reset here. The common tests screen brings up the default protocol to measure chlorophyll, flavanol, anthocyanin and nitrogen flavanol index or NFI. When using MPM outside, GPS is displayed on the lower right of this screen. Hold down the power button to switch the MPM100 off. Data download 
is via a USB port and cable. Two gigabytes of internal storage are provided. Batteries are fitted below the leaf clip. Contact your local ADC Bioscientific Support Centre for more information.